So another race being watched very closely across Tennessee. Voters choosing the next governor of the state. And the winner will replace Republican Bill Haslam. He is wrapping up a second and final term as governor. The former Nashville Mayor Carl Dean is the candidate on the Democratic side of the ballot. He's facing off with Republican nominee and Nashville businessman Bill Lee. Justin Soto has been following this race and he joins us live from the state capitol in Nashville tonight. Well, good evening from the state capitol here in downtown Nashville. It is a beautiful election day as we await the start of a new chapter in Tennessee politics. Of course, a big part of that story is going to be the race for governor. And of course, Republican candidate for governor Bill Lee early voted this morning in his hometown of Franklin here in Middle Tennessee. Lee is a businessman and cattle farmer who hopes to make his way to the capitol, of course, and he has no political experience. His Democratic opponent, Carl Dean, made last minute campaign stops today in Chattanooga as well as in Knoxville, Tennessee. You're looking at video from his rally last night in Memphis. A big question tonight is how those record-breaking early voting numbers are going to impact the race for governor. Of course, in many regions in the Tri-Cities area saw record-breaking early voting turnout, and of course, both candidates have reacted to that. I'm encouraged by the incredible turnout around the state. I'm encouraged by the interest in this election, and I feel really good about where we are. We're just excited about the prospects and we're grateful for all of the excitement, all the turnout. The latest polls are showing Republican Bill, D Bill Lee is leading Democrat Carl Dean as of right now, but of course it is still anyone's game. And I did just speak to Lee's campaign. They told me that he's going to be spending time with his family today in Middle Tennessee before he heads to his watch party tonight in Franklin. Meanwhile, Carl Dean is on his way here to Nashville from Knoxville. Of course, we're going to have the very latest throughout the rest of the night for you. But for now, reporting live in Nashville, I'm Justin Soto, News Channel 11 in your corner.